we're flooring it. We're going to turn right. And, um... Yeah. The AI vehicle is still there. Okay. Yeah, that's totally how you're supposed to take off in this thing. <laughs> that's totally how you take off. Definitely how you're supposed to take off. Alrighty, hello guys, welcome to Faces, back to another Stormworks Build and Rescue video. Today we are checking out the Augusta 109 in-gen transport helicopter, which is actually this thing right here. Of course it is a transport helicopter, so uh, actually doing missions and rescuing people probably isn't really what it was supposed to be used for, but um, we can probably do it. So, let's go ahead and try and get inside, if we can. We get a paintable indicator right there. I don't know how you get inside. <laughs> I don't know how you get inside of this thing. Cabin door, here we go. Uh, we can probably see the buttons from the inside, rather than the outside. So let's have a little look around. Yes, compact pilot seat. Um, oh, I guess there's actually no window here, so we could have just jumped in. Yeah, we could have actually just jumped in. Weird. Anyway, uh, what do we have? We have power. Yes. We have turbine starter. We have an e-brake. We have fuel pump engage. We have hover. And we have a turbine throttle. Okay, so we're going to put this to full. We're going to hold this on. We're going to... Okay, we're good. I think we're actually good. Yeah. Alright, let me go up. Um, so, you might be wondering why I actually chose this thing. I chose this thing because it actually looks really sleek. And I think it just looks really good. It does. It looks really, really good. So, we're just going to go up. Hopefully, I'm in the right seat for this. I don't know whether I am. I don't think I am. I'm going to jump in this seat. I think I'm in the right seat now. Yeah, okay. It's this seat we wanted. We're going to go up. And, um, yeah, let's go. Is it because hover's on? It might be because hover's on that we can't actually go up. Oh, there we go. Oh, nice. Oh, dude, this thing is this thing is cool. Oh, oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. It doesn't feel right when I do that, but um, it's fine. Things are working and stuff. We're just going to fly over to that destination over there. 21 kilometers away. It's so far. It's so far away, but um, it's okay. This is fine. Alright, so I didn't realize there was actually any missions where we picked them up from the creative island, but uh, apparently there is. So we're going to get over here. I need to put my landing gear back down. There we go. And we can just go in there and land, I think. Yeah, look at it. Oh, this is awesome. Uh, so the collective actually, it seems to go back to zero unless you're holding up. And uh, sometimes even when you're holding like up, it starts shaking the entire helicopter. So I don't really know what that's about, but uh, it's a thing. And it is a thing. <laughs> it's a thing, and it's a thing. So, um, yeah. Well, anyway, we're going to go down. We're going to land. We're going to pick up all of these dudes. There's apparently a lot of them. Can I put hover on? There we go. Hover. Oh, my God. It just smacked me into the floor. That's not what hover's supposed to do, I don't think. Not really. All right. Go ahead and uh, turn this down a bit. There we go. Good. Oh, I don't have enough seats for everybody. There's no way I have enough seats for everybody. Anyway, open up the doors. That's fine. Oh, no, we do. There's only four dudes. There's only four dudes. All right, pick you up. Follow me, follow me, and follow me. Let's go. Let's go. All right, get inside, you. Yes. All right, one's in. Okay, go ahead and put you in the far one. Two's in. Three's in. And can I jump in? I don't know if I can actually get in with this dude. Oh, uh, oh we're all in. All right, that was easy. Where are we going? <laughs> Where are we going? I don't know. Is this the wrong seat? I think so. All right, turn it back up. Here we go. Hover. I don't know why it did that. That was really weird. But um, it sort of smacked us down into the ground. That was weird. Anyway, where are we taking these people? All the way up to here. Where are we going? What is this? Hold on. Let's figure this out. So it says... I need to hover the, over this. Uh, passengers require transport to fishing village. Oh, it's easy. Okay, this thing is actually very easy to do. Um, I think I'm actually going to make the weather worse so that we can actually try this thing out in bad wind and rain and stuff like that. Because otherwise, this is far too easy. Okay, wind and a little bit of rain. This is kind of how I've been flying it the entire time, by the way. Uh, literally pointing pretty much towards the ground and just holding, like, up. And it's just been flying, which is insane. <laughs> I mean, this looks a bit insane, doesn't it? Uh, that's pretty crazy, but um, it actually seems to work pretty well. Uh, it flies really nicely, and um, I'm thinking maybe we can actually just keep going. I was going to 
maybe switch out at this island, but I guess that doesn't really make too much sense. So we're going to keep going, and in a few seconds... Oh, actually, we need to raise up the landing gear. There we go. I've also uh, selected this to be on too, which um, is actually pretty cool because, yeah, the collective doesn't go back down to zero, which is obviously really nice. Oh, wow, okay, wait, 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 what is that? What is that? Hold on, there is an AI ship. Oh, there is an AI, is that an AI ship? What is this? All right, let's go down a little bit, and uh, we'll figure this out, right? Turn this off. Let's go down, slightly, come on. Yeah, you've got, like, no control over this thing when it goes down. You need to sort of increase the, the collective, which doesn't make much sense. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. Oh, wow, yeah, this thing's... Actually a little bit, I don't know, hard to fly because of the collective, which is really weird. That is actually really, really strange. Um, but AI ships, pretty awesome, right? Pretty awesome. Just floating around, bobbing around in the ocean. That's so cool. You know what? These guys don't actually want to get to their destination, do they? I really don't want to get to the destination either. It's just a really long journey, and all we'll be doing is landing. So how about we... <laughs> this is how you have to fly this thing. <laughs> You, like, point the propeller forwards, and that's just how it flies, uh, which is kind of interesting. But anyway, we're going to crash into this AI ship because reasons. If I can even fly this helicopter. Oh, I'm just going to smack into the water. Oh, and take off again. Perfect. All right, go forwards. Come on. Is he just sat still? I've never really messed with the AI at all, so I don't know how this goes. Okay, right. I, I, I crashed. <laughs> I crashed. Let me out. Let me out of the helicopter right now. Oh, God. Okay. Right. We're good. We are good. Oh, don't cut me up. Don't cut me up. Oh, God. The, the back blade almost got me. Oh, dude. I'm going to get on this ship and see what he does. Because I, I, I honestly have no idea what he's going to do. I've not seen an AI ship do anything yet. So, I don't really know. Can we control this thing? I don't know how this works. I have no idea how this works. Can I do anything? All right, okay, so uh, let's have a little look around this boat then, because it's just random, it's just here, so we'll have a quick little look around. We've got uh, like a little canteen area, a little kitchen, we can go through here, we've got a bedroom, yeah, like a bedroom, a shower. If we go downstairs, presumably we've got an engine room, which we do. Uh, this thing's actually pretty awesome, so it doesn't appear to be running, and I don't think we can do anything, like, yeah, okay, I can flick the lights, but it doesn't do anything. Where's the dude? There's actually no one on bot. oh, no, there is. He's just not moving it. This is weird. This is really strange. Can I turn it on? I can't actually do it. Oh, oh, oh. No, I can't do anything here, but like... That's weird. He's just not moving. That's strange. That's really, really strange. But anyway, um... That's just a thing. Alright, cool. There's just AI ships. Don't know how that helicopter's still sort of running. I don't understand how that works, but it is. Um, yeah. I don't know. Okay, so I don't really know what this is. Um, I mean, it's a fishing boat. It doesn't move. The, the AI isn't actually piloting it at all. So I don't really understand what's going on. I also don't know what's going on with my helicopter. Why are the propellers still spinning? I mean, the engine's, the engine's working down there underwater, which is kind of crazy. Anyway, um, don't really know what else to do. How about we grab a plane and uh, we fly it into this boat? <laughs> because why not, right? Because why not? Alright, so we've actually got this ultralight thingamabobby right here. It says it's called a stylish ultralight, which is called the CG2A. Uh, and it actually looks pretty awesome. So, uh, all we're actually going to do with this thing is turn it on, I guess. We're just going to we're just gonna whack it on. Here we go. Main electrics. We're going to turn on the ignition. We're going to turn on the, the nav lights, the strobe lights, the cockpit light. Why not? Uh, pack your brake on slash off. And yeah, we're actually good to go. So let's go. Here we go. Yeah. Tail steering. I need that on. There we go. Wait, lock it? No, I don't want to lock it. I don't want to lock it at all. I, I want to turn, please. Oh, there we go. We're turning. Oh, dude, this is awesome. Uh, literally, the only reason we're actually even going to fly this thing is to smack it into a boat. So, uh, that's just a thing that's happening. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay. We're in the sky. All right. Yeah, so this thing isn't actually very powerful. Um, it's using a tail rotor to actually fly, which is actually pretty insane. I like that. And, um, it actually looks really nice, too. It actually does. It looks really, really cool. Um, but yeah, we're actually not gonna do anything except smack it into a boat, okay? Uh, unless, actually, let's try a landing, like, on that island right there. 
and see if we can actually do like a stall, like short takeoff and uh, and landing, because that'd be pretty cool. That'd be really cool, actually. Okay, so let's go ahead and turn ourselves around. We'll try and land on like that helipad, I guess. I don't know if this is a good or a bad idea or what, but like, we'll just whack the brakes on already. There we go, parking brake on. And we'll smack it down on the helipad. I, I think it'll take off way easier than it's going to be to land it, but... Yeah, this is going to be uh, quite tricky, I think. Quite, quite tricky, maybe. All right, here we go. Here we go. I don't want to overshoot it. We do feel like we're going quite fast. Okay. Okay, yeah, no. This isn't going to work. I don't I don't even want to attempt it. I just, I'm not very good. <laughs> I'm not very good at flying. Also, it's just get a little bit laggy. Um, one of the reasons it might be, like, we've obviously got our helicopter still spawned in. We've got that boat there as well. Uh, but there's another boat behind us as well, which is actually quite big, too. Okay, so instead of literally just ramming it into the ship, we're actually going to try and land this thing on the airfield, because we can. Uh, the lag is a little bit annoying, I'm not going to lie. It is, it is definitely quite annoying. But, uh, it is definitely... Wait, a passenger has died during transport. So the mission failed. What? The passenger died? What passenger? We've got a flare on top of this thing. How do I use that? How do I use that flare? Strobe lights, landing lights. No? Okay, I don't know how that works. But anyway, let's go ahead and land. Come on. Wait, we got flaps, right? That's a thing in this? I thought... Oh, takeoff flaps. There we go. Oh! Emergency flare! We're going down! Mayday, mayday! <laughs> mayday, mayday! <laughs> oh god, okay. Yeah, it's got a little bit, like, laggy. Uh, so, flying this thing's actually turned out to be quite difficult. It's not a difficult thing to fly, though, so it doesn't make any sense. Okay, never mind. We'll just jump back into it, and, um, I've cleared the vehicles. I don't know whether that clears AI vehicles or not, but I'm sure it'll be fine. Anyway, we're gonna go ahead and do all of this. There we go. Uh, we're just gonna go for it. Here we go. We're flooring it. We're gonna turn right, and, um... Yeah, the AI vehicle is still there. Okay, yeah, that's totally how you're supposed to take off in this thing. <laughs> that's totally how you take off. Definitely how you're supposed to take off. I mean, that was pretty insane. But, um, yeah, let's ram the boat. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Come on, turn ourselves into it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, don't crash. I don't want to crash. That's, like, definitely not what I want. That is really not what I want. Okay, here we go. Here we go. And, okay, it literally did nothing to it. Do you even damage them? I don't, I don't think you even damaged them. Like, we smacked into that there, and it didn't damage it at all. I don't know. Do these not get damaged at all? This is crazy. This is crazy. I don't know. I honestly don't know what's going on. Anyway, um, it was actually kind of interesting to see all of this stuff. Uh, we can't use these AI ships, but that's okay. The helicopter we started off with was actually pretty good. Um, just got a few issues with, like, the collective going to zero all the time. That's really strange. But, uh, other than that, it was actually pretty awesome. Uh, that plane is actually very, very cool. Uh, it's just when it's a little bit laggy, uh, it's kind of hard to control. Because the, the controls on it are, um, kind of slow, I guess. But anyway, uh, I'm gonna end this video here for now. Thank you guys very much for actually watching this. If you guys want to check out either of the vehicles I used, then they'll both be linked down below. And you guys can check them out for yourselves. Anyway, thank you for watching. See you in the next one. Goodbye.